Hey everyone. Hi. Welcome back. Welcome back. Well, welcome back to me, right? <laughs> welcome back to my channel. We're gonna do some puzzles today. It's been a little while. I know. I have really missed filming. It's, it's probably been like a month, I think. And it just feels like it's been, it's feel like it's been a lot of months. So it feels like it's been way longer than it has been. Let's see. What are we gonna do today? Let's, oh, look at this Sesame Street. Let's do Sesame Street. feel like I haven't filmed in months. I hope everyone's doing great. How's everyone? Appreciate y'all sticking around. Some of you guys have hit me on social media. On um, Instagram. I do see. I, I have been. Um, not every day. But I have been checking comments on here. You guys leave comments and things. But um, I wouldn't say I'm super active on Instagram, but I, you know, I post on Instagram. I, uh, Instagram is where I am most active as far as social media is concerned. Um, aside from YouTube. But uh, Instagram, I'll post things and, you know, even if it's just like a meme in my story, I'm more active there, but... So many guys have hit me there. Thank you. I'm fine. I've been, I've been insanely busy. So busy, like <laughs> I should be asleep right now instead of filming. But I honestly couldn't. I keep putting it off. I've been so busy. I I just don't have the time. Um, so something had to take the back burner and YouTube was that thing. Um, I don't know who Sweetums is. That's what I'm looking for right now. I don't know who that is on Sesame Street, but yeah, I've been Sweetums. YouTube had to take back seat. And there were so many times where I'm like, okay, I'm going to film today. I'm going to film. And then I'm doing things and I turn around and it's super late and I'm like, I'm going to bed. <laughs> I'm going to bed. Or you know what? I'm not even filming today. So yeah, I've been I've been so busy, but um let's see Muppets. But also um I think I was kind of burnt out a little bit. I w was making like five videos a week. Sunday through Thursday was like my schedule to upload on YouTube and sometimes I will pre-record videos and then schedule it out but I didn't always have the time or I wouldn't always pre-film things so sometimes it'll be that day that I upload um but I try to be consistent with my channel since I've since I've started my channel I've never gone like I don't think I've gone like a full month without uploading at least one video a week so i was uploading sunday to thursday you know a, a week here and there maybe it would maybe a few videos instead of five but pretty consistent i like to be consistent with my youtube with everything i like to be consistent um but I wasn't, I just, I'm just not, um, I still have to really do this. I have so much going on and so much that I'm doing. 
I need to really sit down and write out a schedule and get things a little bit more organized because I kind of, I'm, I will do one task and kind of let myself get carried away and spend way more time on it than I should. And yeah, I just don't like doing things that way. So hopefully um, I will figure out a schedule soon. I do not know that I will be uploading five times a week, but um, I am for sure going to be uploading weekly. I think I've been saying for the past couple of weeks, when people ask like in a comment or you guys will message me and I'm like, yes, I am uploading this week and then it just hasn't happened. <laughs> so I'm sorry about that. I really do. I really, really, really do like to be consistent on my channel. I don't like to like, you know, mess the flow up. Or have people wonder, oh, when are you going to upload again? And I don't want to do like a random upload thing. I don't like that. Because um, I know for me, I don't know who Gladys is, but that's who I'm looking for. <laughs> for me, when, I'm, when I subscribe to somebody on YouTube, I often check that. Like if I watch somebody's video and... I like it. I'll go to their channel and check it out. But then, you know, sometimes you find that's, that people were consistent and then they haven't posted in like months or sometimes like a year or more. And you're like, okay. I'm not even going to subscribe to this person's channel because they're clearly not active anymore or consistent or anything. So I just like to stay consistent. Here's Gladys. But, um,. I've been really, really busy. And yeah, I think I was, I think I um, was a little burnt out from YouTube and needed a little change of, change of pace, you know? last one is Hilda yeah I need a little change but I'm, I really missed I really miss YouTube but I, I really literally every night I'm like oh I'm gonna film and then I just would not get around to it <laughs> uh, let's see oh look at this call <laughs> causes of stress <laughs> that's funny Look at this pregnancy, <laughs> a divorce, exams, uncertainty. That's a good one. I can relate to that. Unemployment. Okay. Interviews. Interviews always gave me anxiety. Always. It doesn't matter how much I would prepare. It would give me anxiety. Um, however, I would say I winged a lot of, <laughs> I winged a lot of, uh, interviews. Oops, I put operation. Well, there was an S right after it. I winged a lot of interviews in my life. <laughs> And to be honest, I always felt like um, the interviews I did best at were the interviews where I did a combination of, of winging and preparing. So I'll prepare certain questions that I felt like I knew I'd probably be asked or questions that I felt like were a little bit more like I needed some practice on. But, um, you know, I'll practice a few of those questions, you know, the, you know, the questions that are always asked, like, 
tell me something about yourself or you know something like that but then i would kind of wing wing it with other questions i feel like those interviews always went well uncertainty but i haven't been on an interview and i forever <laughs> I've been working for myself for a very long time. I could not even imagine going on an interview. After so long, that would be very stressful. <laughs> that would be very, um, that would give me a lot of anxiety. Divorce. I hope everyone is doing well though. Um, things are uh, things are looking up as far as this pandemic. I guess as as I guess it's looking as best as it can be, you know, with things everything opening up more and vaccines becoming available and. Um, okay, here we go. Um, uh, unemployment is still, you know, at a very high rate, but at least in New York it is. I don't know about everywhere else, but I know, um, some schools are opening back up. I think. I think teachers had to get the vaccine and then um i do know some schools are opening back up some schools are like part-time but you know things are opening back up and getting a bit more different it's starting to feel Definitely not like it was before, but it's starting to feel a little bit like, okay, we're getting somewhere, you know? But I um, hope everyone is doing well. I'm doing great. Um... Yeah, my time away from YouTube just had to do with me being busy. I um very busy, but I feel very fortunate and very grateful for all the things that are going on in my life right now. So I'm I'm very pleased. I'm pleased with everything right now. Uh, let's see. Food or drink containers? Huh. Facial expressions. Let's try that. Feels so weird. I haven't done a puzzle. <laughs> Even when I'm not when I'm not filming YouTube. Um, I usually don't. I usually don't reach for my um, puzzle book. I thought I saw a word. Yeah, it's actually very late right now. <laughs> and I should be asleep. But I couldn't let one more day go by without 
to stop filming. Um, I'm I'm thinking about going. I've been thinking about going live too. I'll probably go live. Um, oh, I don't even know what day of the week it is today. <laughs> it is a Wednesday. Honestly, can't even say when I'm gonna go live. I have, I don't even know. I just have so much to do. I don't know what day is what and. <laughs> But I, I do want to go live. Um, I want to go live this week. So I'll probably go live this weekend. Yeah. Maybe um Saturday. Amazement. Amazement. And if you if you um follow me on my other channel, oh my goodness, I did post there more recently I think than I posted here. I don't post as often though on my other channel. Um, but oh goodness, I have so many videos I have to edit for my other channel. I just not. <laughs> it has been ridiculous. Um, so I feel like nails and beauty stuff, my other channel has that. And I've been uploading recently, the last, all of the last videos I've been uploading are all nail videos. But I have so, so many videos I have to edit for that channel. And I really don't know when I'm going to get around to it. It's really come to the point where I, honestly, I need, like, an assistant or something. <laughs> I, I've been saying this for a while, that I need an assistant, but I really, really, really need an assistant. Because I cannot do everything. I'm doing everything, and I don't even know how I manage it. Worry, here we go. Okay, done with this. Let's see again. Do I want to do? I'm gonna do um one or two more. Ghosts. Hmm. Oh, look at this. You as fashion designer. Let's do that. You know, I've been waiting for my new Vogue shoe and it has not come yet. Let's see, today's the 24th. Usually it comes uh, mid-month. Mid, yeah, I'm going to say mid-month. It usually comes way ahead of the next month. So, so like February came mid-January sometime or something like that. So I've been waiting for it. Um, it has not arrived yet. I don't know. Let's see. Ralph Lauren. Oh, I say all the time I love Ralph Lauren. But at least if you watch my when I do the um, Vogue magazine look through, they usually always have a Ralph Lauren ad in there. I love Ralph Lauren. It's always mentioned in those, those videos. Bill Blast, oh my goodness. That's, I haven't, I haven't heard that name in a very long time. Is Bill Blass even still a thing? I used to love, I used to love that brand. Gwen Stefani, oh, interesting. I don't know, she was considered a designer. And Lady Gaga 
is Lady Gaga really a designer? Where have I been? Like, I know certain artists have, you know, they might have a, um, clothing or, like, contribute, but, I don't know. No, they were considered a designer. Donna Karen. A lot of little throwback. What I consider throwback uh, designers. Like, you know, these are like old designers that I grew up on. Most of these designers. Michael Kors. I've never been a fan of Michael Kors. Um, anything. I've had a few Michael Kors pieces, but I'm never like on a, on a search for Michael Kors anything or like, I don't know, just not my thing. Marc Jacobs. I used to love Marc Jacobs. I don't really check for Marc Jacobs stuff anymore. Oh, I haven't done a puzzle in a while, but um, I'm knocking them out. I'm knocking them out. I haven't been stuck in Klein. I've been recently, actually, I've been seeing a lot of inclined things um, that I've been liking. I think because I've been looking at Macy's more, and usually I, I'm not big on shopping at Macy's. Um, at least I never usually go like on the website. If I'm in the neighborhood and Macy's is there, I might, you know, stop in and check it out, but. Um, I have been, I actually got the Macy's app and I have been looking on Macy's a lot. I bought, I bought a good amount of things in the last year from Macy's that I'm very, very happy with, but I've seen some very cute Ann Klein jackets. Um, that I wanted very, very cute. Forward. Macy's is just a bit overbearing, at least in New York. The one on 34th Street is huge. And I went in there recently with a friend and we were just kind of browsing and walking around. And we were checking out different floors and I'm like, I didn't even know some of this, some of these floor existed, like some of the floors. and. And let alone some of the areas. I'm like, I didn't even know this was here. It's, that place is huge. And it's like, unless you're going in there for something specific. Or, you know, maybe if you're looking for shoes. Or maybe you're looking for, you like a certain brand. And you go to that brand area. Otherwise, you would just be in there all day. Like, you can be in there all day. Just browsing. And just get completely lost and if you have a shopping problem you'll be in there just spending up all your money because there's literally something for everyone is this supposed to say Vera Wang or is that someone else I don't know Jessica Ray and Lady Gaga okay we found everything here I just found Lady Gaga Oreos. I don't know if you guys have seen it, but um, she did like an Oreo collaboration. And it's like, the packaging is cute. The Oreo is pink and green. It's pink cookie and then green filling. Oreos are my favorite cookie. I haven't really been um, eating them much in the past year. And I, I used to really keep up with like 
every Oreo that came out I wanted to buy and try but I kind of stopped that it was just too much <laughs> too too much sweets and things like that um but I just found her her Oreos they came out I think in February or March and they're like limited I'm looking for this last word um, oh they're limited so I did want to get them just because of that and I found two packs it was the last two packs and I bought them I still haven't tried them yet though <laughs> I'm waiting for um, waiting for a day where I feel like eating something that sweet because I know it's gonna be very sweet but anyway I'm gonna end the video here thank you guys so much for watching I miss you all I missed filming and um, Hopefully, I will get back to my regular schedule. Actually, no, I am going to, like I said, I'm going to, um, I'm going to figure out, sit down and figure out my schedule and see what days work best for me to film. Um, and stay consistent, but you guys will, will for sure see me every single week. I cannot guarantee that it's going to be five times a week like I was doing before but it's definitely gonna be multiple times a week and um yeah thank you guys so much for watching I'm gonna end it here I'm going to sleep <laughs> and hopefully you guys can do the same or get some rest relax or just you know whatever you're doing while you're watching this video so thank you so much for watching I'll see you guys next time. Um, take care of yourselves. Bye.